Today, up to 75% of all emerging diseases come from animals. And as we are cutting down forests and destroying habitats, we are creating the ideal conditions for diseases to spill over from one animal to another and then to us. And we can no longer separate the health crisis from the ecological crisis. And we cannot separate, separate the ecological crisis from the climate crisis. It's all interlinked in many ways. And during this pandemic, we have seen what we can achieve when we put resources into science. Vaccines were developed in record time. But so far, on average, one in four people in high-income countries have received a coronavirus vaccine, compared with just one in over 500 in low- and middle-income countries. In the international community, governments and vaccine developers must step up their game and address the tragedy that is vaccine inequity. You can shove your climate crisis up your arse. You can shove your climate crisis up your arse. You can shove your climate crisis. You can shove your climate crisis. You can shove your climate crisis up your arse.